Hi guys and welcome to 123 MyT's video where we look at transferring data from your Oppo phone across to your Samsung Galaxy S10 phone. In this video we will show you how to transfer apps, pictures, videos, music, contacts and any data that's on your Oppo phone across to your Samsung phone. And actually these steps should work with any model of Android phone so why not give it a try. And lastly it'll still work without having to move your SIM card. Okay so you're going to need your USB-C connector that came with your Samsung phone and you're also going to need the cable that came with your Oppo phone or your Android phone. What we're going to do is simply plug in the Samsung USB connector to your Oppo cable and we're going to plug the devices in together one on the other side and you'll see on our Samsung device here we've got the smart switches just come up automatically and we're going to hit OK on that one and we've got two options here we want to send data which means we want to send data to the Oppo phone or we're going to receive data so we're going to receive all the data and our new phone is the Samsung phone we're going to go receive data Okay, it says it can't connect until we turn on file transfer mode on our old phone. So to do that, we just want to swipe down and select charging via USB more options. And then we're going to hit photo transfer. Once that's done, we should be able to hit receive data again. It says open smart switch on your old device. So I've already got it downloaded, but you can get it from the Google Play Store if you need to. Smart switch. Okay, you can see I've already got it downloaded, so we don't need that at this stage. So we're going to open up Smart Switch. All right, connecting to your Galaxy S10e, which is what it should do. You can see on our Samsung phone here now, it says we've got 15 gig of data, which will take about 46 minutes. So make sure that you've, you've charged your, both your phones as well. And we're just going to take off what we don't need. So don't need images, don't need apps, don't need bookmarks. And just for the sake of the video, I'm just going to transfer calls and contacts so it's nice and quick. But if you leave all these all ticked, they will all transfer across. And there you go. So it says we're ready to go. We've copied all our items. And that's all we need to do. We just go close and then done. And then you're done. Now, if you don't have the USB connector, you can still use the Samsung app to transfer wirelessly. So let's just say we unplug those and we're going to find a smart switch again. We're going to receive data. All right, now both of these phones are connected to my local Wi-Fi, so I'm just gonna hit wireless. So we've also got options here of what uh, devices we can receive from. So we can receive from Galaxy Android, we can receive from iPhone, iPad, and we can even actually receive from Windows phones, Blackberries. So we're gonna go Galaxy at this stage and we're going to start up smart switch on our Oppo phone okay let's go we're gonna press wireless okay we're gonna to have to hit accept on our Oppo phone it's gonna give us the option here let's just go ahead and untick everything again and then hit send and we're gonna hit receive on our Samsung all right again we're all done okay guys so that's it, we just hit done there now, and that's it. So now all your data has been transferred from your Oppo across to your Samsung phone. Okay guys, so that's pretty much it from me. If this was a helpful video, don't forget to leave a thumbs up, don't forget to subscribe, and thanks for watching guys. Bye bye.